Hello, this is FUSA bringing you an amazing gameplay that I go 3 and 10 in using Scavenger Pro with a P90 Hardline Delta Pro Skinny Pro engage. Assault Kill Streak comprising of the UAV Care Package and IMS. I also use two FMG9s but not in the actual gameplay. I don't know why. I have a Claymore and some concussion grenades. I also, maybe I forgot to do FMG9s. But I both use my P90 almost completely. I also use rapid fire and extended bags. Extremely good attachments for already extremely good gun because the P90 already has a very large magazine. Using extended mags and rapid fire makes it amazing. Remember, remember in this game that the spawn points are different than most other Call of Duties. Meaning the maps are much smaller, so spawns gonna be crowded, especially the free for all. People will spend s tend to spawn directly behind you, and ver vice versa, you spawn directly behind whoever killed you. Also, like the guy who spawns right behind me right now, that guy <laughs> happens a lot. So watch your back and double back a lot because you'll get a lot more kills that way. At least until they patch the Wii up, which will be soon, hopefully. Because it's annoying to get killed by this, and it's annoying to kill someone. But also, watch your angles and work your angles. Just like in any other actual game, or any real life situation shootout, if you get the best angle to kill people with, they don't see you coming before you blast like 100 bullets at them or something, they're dead. Don't put IMSs out of desperation, put them out of knowledge and need for IMSs. IMSs and free falls are like a godsend gift. Watch so little campers or people who spawn right behind you get rushed and killed. If you don't want to get rushed and killed, watch your corners. Don't just run blindly into a room because you might get killed right from the side. Like this guy who runs blindly over here, doesn't see me. You guys see me shot double back by my piece too late already. Now yeah, I know where he is. If you get UAV shot online. like I did just coming out of the area, you need to reload. I should have switched to my secondary and moved directly to the right. Because this guy's coming at me from the left. It would be much harder for him to shoot me, and I might get a kill, kill and escape. IMS ready for or deployment. he might kill me anyways, but it's a better situation than just rush to the left, get stuck. If you're caught between the crossfire of two people, or your IMS blows up right next to you, make sure you're not put it right behind people like that, because it will blow up and you'll get killed from the uh, blast. Blast radius is pretty big. Pulling claymores very quickly is also a trick out of too much air contact. It really works. Like, the guy circling Care around me when delivery. I was trying to knife, someone's trying to circle around you, the easiest way out of it is a straight line. So rush a straight line in pretty much any direction except the direction he's going. So he'll have to go behind you or circle behind you. UAV which will give you a tactical advantage. UAV if that online. happens to you, well, what can I say? It happens. That was not a random. People fly to a cure package or like bees to honey. So if you put it in a really good place, deployment. I suggest you either get it super quickly or Big on the like again, right Care over there, right in front of everyone to test. Okay, Care besides that, most people who get their care packages for people who want to get care packages, take them, steal them. So, most people will do the other way, but they don't just take it right away. It's either going to be a big care package placed in a random place, or placed right next to them, they don't take it. They're waiting for you to take it, or they're somewhere in the shadows waiting to snipe any person or just blast any person. And quickly recon move. Standing My strategy for basically gun ready any for free for all gameplay where you're using silencers or any gun is stick and move, baby. That Care means stick and move. Like, actually move out of a place. If you're camping and you make your territory this area, and it's in this area, everyone knows where you are. Kill me chicken out if you do that. I would not suggest directly running after them because they will quickly turn and blast you like I did with that other guy. Unless they're really stupid and you know they're not going to do that. Which is probably not true. See? That guy tried to take it out. I tried to take it out. I tried to take it out. Bang. 
See how I stay in a, in a certain area? I move around a lot because the spawns right here are dangerous. Really dangerous spawns because they'll put you behind people all the time. What you want to do is look at them, look at your radar screen from time to time, or use those little searchable things. Those things that when they send out the uh, mini UAV, UAV on your radar, those are extremely helpful with this. UAV online. <laughs> Right here is an uh, example UAV of putting your, uh, putting your IMS in desperation. I should have, well, I really should have putting your IMS in desperation. Air like on the way. Example right after this. What I should have done in, in this area, if two people thought you wouldn't have your IMS in these guys, I should have thrown grenade uh -huh. or uh, cushion or flash grenade. I knew that exactly what happened. When I, like I said, work your angles, work your corners know what's about to happen, figure out the spawn, 